We bring in the star wide receiver for the Atlanta Falcons, the former Bama star Julio Jones, who joins us. How are you, Julio? I'm great. How you doing? You got a problem with me? I got a problem with you. All right. Fire right away. Right off the back. Okay. I uh, want to know uh-oh. why you don't have an Alabama helmet in there. Here you have an Oregon Ducks, yep. a, K, a K-State helmet, yep. but no Alabama helmet. Well, here's the problem. I had um, I had a McElroy jersey in here, Greg McElroy jersey. Mm-hmm. But if I got an Alabama helmet, I'd be more than happy to display it. I just, you know, I got Notre Dame and Georgia and K State. Those are three of the top five, you know, schools in the country. So if I had an Alabama uh, helmet, I'd put it in here. Can you make that happen? I can make that happen, but you know, we the we the <laughs> number one team in the country. You know. <laughs> Okay, but uh, let me ask you what Steve Spurrier said. Could Alabama beat Jacksonville? <laughs> I don't know. It'll, it's... Well, that's not a no. That means you think you'd at least have a chance. Um, uh, yes, we'll have a chance. Okay, let me. How about if I said last year's Alabama team, or the be... yeah, could they beat the Jacksonville Jaguars? I haven't been watching the Jacksonville Jaguars, <laughs> so I, I can't I can't say Alabama will beat them. But you know, I've been watching Alabama, and they've been playing some good football. Who loses first, Alabama or Atlanta? Neither. Oh no, you got to make a pick. That's the way it Ain't works no on you. Hi, you see, you didn't say that. Okay, you got you, you to make a pick, Julio. <laughs> now you gonna say I got to make a pick? <laughs> you got to tell me that will, beforehand. Okay, are both of you gonna go undefeated? Then is that what you're saying? You're predicting the Falcons will run the table. Well, we, you know, like, I guess, Coach Saban telling his guys that, you know, Mike Smith over here telling us, we're just going to take it one one game at a time. Oh, you know? come on. One game. If Saban was yelling at you and he was mad at you, mm-hmm. how would you know? How would I know he was yelling? Mad at mad, you, yeah. He's yelling. Oh, he would if yell. Mad, yeah. If he's mad, he'll, he'll come and put you on the spot. Okay, give me an example. I'll be you. And I just huh? I just made a mistake, and you walk over the sideline, and you're Coach Saban. What are you doing? He I, gonna, he gonna, first of all, he's going to ask you, what are you doing? Um, I was just running the play. <laughs> no, no, no. You got to have – there's no excuse with Coach Saban. Oh, no, okay. You, yeah, I mean, like, as <laughs> far as uh, preparation, yeah. he's going to make sure, you know what I'm saying, you're on, a, you're on the right page, you got the right mindset, everything before the game. And then you go out there, you know, you screw up or something. Like – He's going to get on to you, but at the same time, he's going to be like, hey, he's going to put you back out there and give you another opportunity, you know, to step up and, and don't make the same mistake twice. Who scares you more when they yell at you, Mike Smith or uh, Coach Saban? I mean, I don't get yelled at. You know, I, I go out there and try to do my job. Oh, you don't get yelled at by Coach Smith? No. Nah. Oh, look at you. Uh, hey, how are you and uh, Drew Davis doing with the uh, Oregon-Alabama uh, rivalry? You guys uh, – Needle each other. You got to bet on uh, who's going to be the national champion. Well, he's that's the Ducks. I don't know. He was like he was. He said he wanted to bet me, you know, on the Ducks or whatever. But if they make it, though, I don't know. <laughs> well, you got to put something on the line with your teammate there. But but you know you know you got Notre Dame out there still. So it depends on whose schedule is the strongest or whatnot. I don't watch those guys. I don't watch Oregon or Notre Dame, so I wouldn't know. I just watch Alabama, and I know you know we're going to be there. He's uh, Julio Jones, Falcons wide receiver, joining us, Dan Patrick Show. How much does it bother you that the national media is not looking at the Falcons, you know, for being a great team or giving them a lot of publicity? Uh, we, I mean, we here at the Falcons, we don't, we don't, we don't mind it at all, man. Um, you know, like I said, we're gonna take it one game at a time, and I mean, we just got to go out there and our respect. People always say we haven't played nobody yet, and then the teams we they they say gonna beat us or you know. We, we always find a way to win. And, and I know just playing at Alabama, you know, great teams always find a way to win. It doesn't matter who you're playing. And then, especially being in the NFL, like any given Sunday, you can lose a game. But we always find a way to win. So we got a good ball club here. Second, or uh, give me the best team you, you faced this year so far. Best team? Yeah. The Cowboys was a pretty good team. Um, we play, like, when we play people, it's like everybody else don't get the same look that we get, you know, and like especially like for game planning. Um, when we come into games, we we just got to make adjustments as we're playing a lot because we got so many weapons on offense and we don't know who's going to be that go-to guy that game. So everybody got to come to play. 
You know, we don't know if Roddy or me are going to get double, or Tony and Rod, or, or me and Tony. You know, so it's like everybody's got to basically come to, uh, come to play, and you can't really put plays in like throughout the week for for one person. You know, everybody got to have like a whole a bunch of plays basically. So when it when their numbers getting called, you know, they got to be able to step up, make those plays, and then you know just use the defense. Whatever uh, defense they have, whatever coverage they have, you know, we got plays for that guy as well to uh, make plays. How can you guys let Tony Gonzalez retire? I told him, I told him he, he can't retire. He was like, well, you know, well, because I was, I was telling him, thank you one game. I was like, yeah, I'm glad they dubbed you. Or they, or they rolled up on you, and I, you know, I got over the top, and, you know, I was open. He was like, yeah, it ain't going to be like that next year. I was like, you got two or three more years. Okay, be, be honest. Do you think that he'll retire? I don't know. I, I don't – I mean, it's hard. You know, I mean, he, he feels real good right now. You know, we talk to him and everything. He feels real good. He's in, he's in great shape, great shape. So, I mean, he probably just talking, but, you know, he probably just want to, I don't know, go out on top. I, I don't I don't know. Well, if you win the Super Bowl, then mm-hmm. it might be more likely that he would retire. That's a possibility. I mean, it's, it's strong, you know, because – you know, a guy like Tony, he's been in the league, you know, that long and and, and hasn't won the Super Bowl. So he's pretty good. He's great. He's a great player. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you take care of the Alabama helmet. I'll put it on display in the man cave. All right. Okay. So I'll live up to my end of the bargain. Let me see if you got any power left. If you call and they go Julio, who, then I'll know. <laughs> I got power. I got. I got a little. I got a little bit. Just a little bit. You know. All right. I thought I can get you a helmet. All right. We'll see. I get you. I get your helmet with number eight on it when I was there. Whoa. Oh, you want one? Oh, you want one with fifteen on there? Because I think this was going to do. It's going to win. It's going to be the fifteen national championship. To, uh, yeah. How do we have? No, no, so. I want eight. Okay, I okay. want eight. Okay, all right. Okay, I get you eight. All right. Good luck against the Saints. Thanks for joining us. Yeah. All right. Thank you. All right, Julio Jones. Got a problem? You'll all solve it. I mean, that's just how it works. Check out the hook.